Thousands of protesters have taken to the streets to march against 20 years of mandatory detention of refugees in Australia. In Melbourne, 1,400 protesters tore through a giant run-through banner in a symbolic act of pulling down the fences around refugee detention prisons. The rallies marked the annual World Refugee Day and highlighted the fact that 2012 is the 20th anniversary of the introduction of the policy of mandatory detention in Australia. For 20 years we've ignored our own laws, our own human sensibilities, international convention, and we've taken the world's most vulnerable people and locked them behind bars. The very same person who decides whether they're locked up is the same person that decides what access to rights they have, their welfare, and how they should be treated. It is an absolute conflict of interest to allow the jailer to be the guardian of these children. marks the 20th uh, year of mandatory detention. Okay, for 20 years, successive Australian governments, with the assistance of the commercial media, have run a hate campaign and a fear campaign to manufacture and manipulate racism for their own political gain. 20 years of mandatory detention is 20 years too long of this abuse, and we call for an end to this barbaric policy now. whole country is built on a history of, of refuge and people being refugees and people fleeing other unsafe places to come to a place of safety. It is just crazy for Australia to spend so much money locking up people in a way that ser doesn't serve them and doesn't serve us. We live in a country where a pregnant mother of two young boys all proven refugees can be found a threat to national security. For a secret reason and by a secret process, they can be dragged out of their home in Melbourne and thrown in detention a thousand kilometres away. We are here to say enough mandatory detention, enough unnecessary suffering in the walls of our detention centres, and enough turning our back on international obligations for the sake of scoring a few cheap political points. Uh, we need to change this uh, situation for uh, people in detention center as soon as possible and we fighting as much as we can, we're not going to stop it and we want more people to come and join us.